everybody, what is up? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new, my name's Danielle, but today I could be confused as Mrs. Claus. I know, I know. That was the dumbest joke of my life, oh my god. <laughs> I'm in a very spirited mood today. I've got the Yule Log going. A lot of you guys have asked. I literally just go on YouTube and search Yule Log, and this is just like an at-home fireplace. Well, duh, all fireplaces are at home, but you know what I mean. And I've got my tree. It's just, it's just a good time around here. So today I'm going to be doing one of my most popular, most requested videos that I do every year. It is my Christmas wish list. 2018. Um, this year, I think I'm going to make it more of like a gift guide. These are some things that I wouldn't mind getting for Christmas, but I'm not like sending it to Santa and gonna be like, I want all these gifts, you know what I mean? So these are things that I would love in my life. I think you guys would like them. These are just some really, I don't know, cool ideas um, to ask for for Christmas or if you're getting gifts for friends. I just wrote down some cute stuff. I talked to some of my friends about it. I got Callie's help, Delaney's help. Just wanted to get some input. So I'm just gonna get started. There's really not much to it. I'm gonna have a link to everything I talk about down below as well as little like pictures so you guys can get an idea. I'm so excited about the holidays. Seriously, I've already bought so many gifts for friends and family and I'm just, it's a good time around here, yay! So I'm just gonna start, this is a no order, all different price ranges, just all different things. The big ticket item I have on this list is actually an iPad Pro. Um, recently in a lot of my classes, and Callie has one, um, people have been taking notes on their iPad and I thought that was the coolest idea ever because I don't know like I hate using paper and I hate having like a huge notebook in my backpack that takes up so much space and with the iPad Pro and then the Apple Pencil like I didn't realize this but with the Apple Pencil when you like write on it if your hands leaning on it it doesn't smudge or anything it only writes what the pencil is doing and I think that is so genius needed to be invented ages ago I'm just hearing about it at least and I would love it for my classes next semester I just think that's a really cool idea cool to bring on planes it's just like a little more practical you can read books on it I've just never really had an iPad I had an iPad years ago but like I don't know I just think that'd be cool so that's like the big ticket item another bigger item that you could ask for are Beats headphones they're seriously such a staple I've seen lots of people at the gym just wearing their Beats headphones and it's honestly kind of a vibe I really like the white ones I also really like the silver ones I just think that's a really cool um, gift to get for someone or if there's something like you think you need maybe that's something you need I don't know um, I just love wearing headphones because they really block out the sound especially on airplanes for some reason like my airpods just don't do it. I love airpods you guys would totally love airpods they're absolutely amazing but headphones are absolutely amazing because they really block out the sound again on airplanes they just muffle it all out it helps you kind of zone in more Another thing on my wish list is a new suitcase set because my suitcases are really just, the wheels aren't working that well anymore. And I feel like a suitcase set is just a really cool Christmas gift to get for somebody. Um, I don't know, because you can get ones that like have the big one and then the small one and like a little duffel. It's just you have, you've covered all the bases. There's so many cute suitcase sets out right now. I'll have a couple linked down below. I know CalPak has some. There's this new brand that I've seen around everywhere. It's like this like cream colored suitcase with like tan. I don't know, really cool stuff. So, a suitcase set is a cool gift idea. Hydro Flask, I'm a big Swell bottle user. I really like my Swell, but I'm really intrigued by the Hydro Flasks with the straw. Cause I just don't like how the Hydro Flask water bottles have like this big mouth. Like I just feel like you can spill it all over you. But the straw, now that is something I can get behind. And they have so many cute colors. They have, I think they have a yellow one. They have a hot pink one. They have white, black fits all your needs. The Kardashians use this certain type of blanket. I'm just now hearing about it from the Skinny Confidential podcast called the Barefoot Dreams. I guess they have robes and blankets, Callie informed me. I'm not really sure, but I saw they have a leopard blanket. It looks absolutely amazing. I've heard they're just so dreamy and soft and just just a good time. So Callie, you, you approve of Barefoot Dreams? Yes, of course. I would not recommend any other blanket. <laughs> I would not recommend any other blanket. Well, there you go. So I feel like blankets are always a really cute gift idea. It's just like cozy. It's always cold outside. And um, this one's leopard and I'm into leopard as you guys know. New running sneakers or just sneakers. That's always like a fun gift to get as well. I've had my eye on the Adidas NMDs or also the Hoka. I think that's or Hoku. Um, they're like really for running but I just started running at Orange Theory finally. I still do the bike sometimes, but I've been trying to run more. It is really good for you. And those sneakers are just clouds, so I've heard. So, I don't know. Sneakers are always good, and it kind of gets you inspired to work out for the new year. <laughs> pajamas, always a great gift idea. Everj is one of my now new favorite pajama brands. They sell it at Neiman's, Bloomingdale's, I don't know, all those places, you know. Um, also, I just like go on Revolve. They have a lot of cute Christmas um, PJ sets. Um, yeah, just PJ sets in general are great. I don't want to say the word too loud because I'm close to her, but 
Alexa. <laughs> she didn't hear that. The Amazon Echo, if you don't have one, I seriously love my Amazon Echo. She's absolutely amazing. She's like my right hand gal. I'll wake up, I'll say, Alexa, because I don't want to like trigger y'all's either. Because um, I know you guys will comment being like, mine went off because of your video. I'm like, I'm sorry. I will say Amazon Echo. <laughs> um, what's the weather outside? Or play Christmas jazz. <laughs> Whatever it may be, I absolutely love it. And it's just so fun and you can make the volume louder. It's just, it's basically a speaker, but then also does other things and it's great. I also just finally got the Amazon Echo Dot because I was gonna buy it on Black Friday, but my brother has one and doesn't use it. And that's just like a little guy that kind of like is an extension off of the big one. Um, and I'm gonna put it in my bathroom because I like to listen to music in the shower, I listen to podcasts in the shower, all that. So the Amazon Echo Dot is a lot cheaper, I'm pretty sure it's on sale right now. Maybe not anymore when this is up, but it's a good idea. The Sephora sets, oh my gosh you guys, like, oh that's from Legally Blonde, oh my gosh, oh my gosh you guys, oh so good. Um, sorry I'm a theater geek. <laughs> The Sephora sets are something I look forward to seeing every year, the new sets they come out with, like, they have some that they've kept around for so long, like the one where you get, like, a ton of perfume samples, and then you get to choose which one you like, and you take it into the store, and you get a full-size perfume. I got that for Christmas one year, it was the most exciting thing of my life. There's now a dry shampoo set, which just should have happened ages ago. Dry shampoo is one of my most used products in life. Um, Callie was telling me about it, actually. You just get a ton of mini dry shampoos, and that's great for travel, because I'm usually using dry shampoo when I travel a lot, because I really hate to use like showers at hotels. I don't know, I just get lazy. There's also a beauty blender set, or just like these big beauty blender packages, which are great, because beauty blenders are expensive, so when you get them in a set, it's usually cheaper. Also, did you guys know Beauty Blender came out with like a foundation? Like, what? So yeah, I'll have some of those sets linked down below. They're just so great to get for friends. Like, I'm doing a secret Santa with a ton of my friends, and I think that's a really good gift idea. You guys all need a jade roller in your life, a face roller of some sort. Lymphatic drainage is in, so I have actually right here this jade roller. I literally got it on Amazon for like 12 bucks. I'll have it linked down below, but it's seriously amazing, and it's just so, it's such a good stocking stuffer. You just need it. This is something that's, I'm not even gonna lie, it's on my Christmas list, like I need this. There is a dry bar scented candle. What? If you guys have been to dry bar, you know that every single dry bar salon you walk into all has the same scent. It's just distinct, it makes me happy, I feel at home, and I feel like having a dry bar candle would be cool to like burn in my bathroom, like, <gasps> so that's definitely on my list. The dry bar also has this curling iron called the three day bender. I know Kenzie has it and loves it. I love the curls it gives. Um, so I'll have that link down below as well. I just really like, usually I've always been a wand girl and I still love wands, but this one it like clamps and it like, if you do it right, you get these really dope curls. Next thing on my Christmas wish list are Ember mugs. Callie also introduced me to this. Callie, she's very influential in my life. <laughs> um, and apparently she has one and it's like this coffee mug and there's an app connected to it and you can heat it up and keep it heated up for like hours, your coffee. So you make your coffee in the morning, you put it in this mug and you can literally control it on your phone, right? On the app. And you can also say like, oh, I made a cappuccino and it tells you how hot you should keep it or if it's a latte, whatever. And they also have these bigger ones with lids. I mean, the options are endless and that's a really cool gift idea if you have like a dad that's like takes his coffee to work every morning because I know when I make my coffee and my Keurig every morning, like it, I have to drink it quite fast. Like it, it gets cold. Another great option for gifts are candles. We love candles. My favorite brand of candles is, would probably be Capri Blue. I actually have it right here. My favorite scent, I think this is called Volcano. Yeah, my favorite scent is Volcano but they have some seasonal scents right now. And um, yeah, they, they're online. You can get them in Anthropology, And like boutiques always sell them. It's just like when you walk in Anthropology and you smell something good, it's usually this. Or like Voluspa, I think it's the other brand. Or Bath and Body Works always works too. And then my last few ideas are kind of like more experience related. So um, a lot of you guys have said you wanna join Orange Theory, but it's really expensive. Ask for an Orange Theory membership for Christmas or Get, if someone loves SoulCycle, get them a couple classes. You know, things that benefit them, not just once, but they get to, you know, the gift that keeps on giving. Or like practical things, like a gas gift card. That goes a long way. Us college kids, you know, it happens. Or a grocery store gift card, or Starbucks. I really appreciate Starbucks gift cards because I go every day, sometimes twice a day. Or like maybe a little experience, like going to a theme park for the day, or, Callie's going to New York for Christmas, you know, stuff like that. It's so like, 
I don't know, it's more than just a gift. It's like an experience, it's being with people. Quality over quantity is just a good saying to go by, but um, yeah. I did this video because a lot of you guys wanted it and obviously I've honestly really been into spending money on experiences. I love to travel as you guys know because it really just, I don't know, benefits you in the long run. It's a good time. So yeah, that's everything that I wanted to share with you guys. I will have everything linked down below for you guys to check out. I'm just so excited for the holiday season, even though I'm in the middle of finals right now, so me filming this video is giving me anxiety considering I need to be studying, but that's okay. I love you guys so much. Happy holidays. I'll see you guys soon.